What I like about the Florida Keys is, first of all, it's very accessible. US-1 takes you all the way from Florida City to Key West, so you can stop by at any one of these points and, and scuba dive. And also, the water is very clear, so it creates for a nice, brilliant light underneath. One of the coolest experiences I've ever had is the underwater Christ. I, that I've never seen anywhere else in the world. Here you are, sort of swimming along these, uh, these coral formations, and everything looks like, you know, it's a coral reef, right? And there's, there's the fish, and the grouper, and the snapper. And all of a sudden, you come over this ledge, and you look down, and there's this, this statue, you know, this man-made thing. And it, it looks, uh, you know, I remember my first thought was, my god, I've stumbled onto this lost city, you know? So it's just an unexpected part of the reef. Yet, even though it's unexpected, it fits somehow. It's congruent with the reef. It's congruent with the scenery. It doesn't stand out like a sore thumb. It's almost like you say, yes, of course, there's supposed to be an underwater statue here. Accessible to both snorkelers and divers, the 4,000 pound, nine foot statue sits in 25 feet of water. It was donated to the park in the 1960s and has become a highly popular dive site. 